Hi YouTube, this is your president, the Presidential Terrace, back with another exciting and pretty happy food review video. Um, some of you may remember, I think it's been about a year ago, I did a review on um, some macaroons from a company called Coco Bakery, which I bought these macaroons at Publix. It was something they were having for, I think it was for Halloween. Well, Coco Bakery must have saw my video, but last month they contacted me, said they liked my video, and they wanted to send me some products for me to review on my channel, which I finally got. Now, Coco Bakery is a company based out of Canada, so this was definitely sent a long way. Got the box. I, did, I opened it, but I haven't, really, I haven't looked inside really. All I did was take off the label and open it. What a good size box. I'm assuming there's some tasty stuff in here. Yeah. So let's take a look, huh? Of course, I have um, Lego Batman keeping an eye out for me while I do it. There it goes. Oh. Look at this. Macaroons. Uh, it looks like this is a, this is a deluxe edition. Um, it looks like the brand's called Archer Farms. Soar Collection includes red velvet, salted caramel, or, ca or caramel, salted caramel, and pistachio. Look at that! Isn't that pretty? Look at those colors. Awesome. And there's something else in here. Oh. It's not uh, luxury macaroons, and this time it's under the Coco Bakery brand. Oh, look at that. Strawberry, lemon, and pistachio. Awesome. I have to get a picture of these. Let's see if I can get it first. Um, just give me a second, and then we're going to crack into these bad boys and girls. Got to get a nice picture. Make sure it's all... Uh, do it justice. Uh, okay, I'm gonna flip. Stay with me. Okay, let so me check that. Gotta make sure it's perfect now. Yep. Good. All right. Which one should we get in first? We'll do this one first since this was on top. Very nice of them to send this for me to review. And uh, nutrition facts and ingredients. Let's get going on it. I am excited. Now let's see. Top is must be red velvet. And salted caramel must be in the middle. Pistachio must be in the bottom, I bet. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> this smells nice. Let's just dig in. And again, let's see. This must be the red velvet. Mmm. Ah. My mouth is watering. This is so tasty. Yeah. You can tell you're eating some of this red velvet flavor. This is sweet, delicious. The inside is nice and soft. The outside is a little, a little more firmer, which is perfect for a macaroon, in my opinion. This is so pleasantly um, flavored. I just love it. Mm. You know, I could eat these all day and every day. It's just so good. Oh my god. This one. Mm. 
smell these smell incredible. Oh my god, that's delicious. I'm not sure which flavor I like better. These are seem these to me, it's going to be very high quality, too. They're delicious. And these are the best macarons I ever had. I had a couple different ones. Some in the case at Publix, and I bought some at um, Walt Disney World. But these top them all. I know that. Oh, this is the pistachio. Mmm, do you smell the pistachio? Oh, this is going to be a treat. I think the pistachio is my favorite. These are delicious and incredible. Coco Bakery definitely knows what they're doing when they make these things. These are delicious. There must be some really talented people that are making these great things. I like them. Nothing I can complain about this. I don't know how much this would cost. Um, they didn't give any details on this. How much it would cost in the store. But uh, I'm not even going to guess. You might want to ask them if you're interested in buying some. Not sure they sell this Archer Farms ones around here in Florida or not. You'd have to ask. But oh, just in case you didn't see, net weight is 8.25 ounce, 234 grams. But this is amazing. Really, really good. I'm so happy they sent this and I got to try it. I very much enjoyed the last ones I had. But I think it was only like two flavors. And I'm definitely going to be finishing these off, and it's deluxe edition. Definitely be finishing off later, but very nice. Now let's get on to the other one, shall we? Oh, strawberry lemon and pistachio again. Ooh. Oops, oops. Um, net weight 5.5 ounce, 156 grams. Luxury macarons, of course, it has Coco Bakery logo. And then, um, here's the nutrition facts and ingredients. Hopefully, you see that okay. I'm going to show that briefly. But let's uh, dive in, shall we? Opens up like this, and even though these were in the mail, probably over a week it took to get here, they still seem to be very fresh and very delicious. I'm not sure where the shelf life is on some like this, but they're they're fine. Since if they're all made in Canada, which I'm assuming they are, the, um probably takes quite a while for them to get shipped down to like Publix where I bought the original ones. So they're going to have probably a probably decently long shelf life. Ooh, I smell that. Yeah. I especially smell the lemon in this one. Let's do that first. Mmm. Smells like a nice lemon cake. Something you would have at like um, your grandmother's house or something like that. Or a nice um, restaurant where you have some nice tea and stuff. These are a little softer. But the texture is fine. Mm. Nice and lemony. Yeah, it tastes just like, like a lemon pound cake. Sweet and soft. Delicious. And the flavor is very vivid too. Mm. <laughs> the greens pistachio again. I 
I think out of all these pistachios, my favorite flavor. It's interesting because I usually like lemon, lime, orange flavored things. But this is, the, I think, it's the best one out of all of them. Just like the other one, good quality. Amazing. Mm. Ooh, and strawberry. Mmm. You, yeah, you smell the strawberry on it. It's really strong. Nice. Pleasant. And I like all the different colors. Look at that. It's always good to have different color things when you with your food. The variety makes it more interesting. You think about they don't have to do that, but um, it adds to it definitely. All right. Hmm. That's so good. The filling's incredible. Nice and creamy. I haven't been talking about the filling filling as much. Delicious. Delicious. I figured it would be. Like the last macarons I had from Coco Bakery. But these were definitely out of this world. And I'm so happy I got to try these. It was so nice of Coco Bakery to send these to me to review. Uh, you... Um, I'm going to close this. I know you guys will see this. Thank you, thank you, thank you for sending this. I really enjoyed it. It is delicious. I wholeheartedly encourage people to buy those if you see them in the store. If you like macaroons, you'll definitely like um, these ones from Cocoa Bakery. So keep an eye out. Um, they have a website. If you can't find them in the store, you might be able to order it online. I'm not sure they sell them to individual people. They probably do. Well, you would have to contact the company, check out the website, see. Like I said, they're um, located in Canada, so Canadians will probably have more um, easier access to them than I would or other countries would. But like I said, I found um, the Cocoa Bakery macaroons at a Publix in Central Florida. So they are selling here in the United States, and I'm sure other countries as well. So keep a lookout for them, and give them a try, and uh, let me know what you think. And if you do contact them, let them know you saw this video. And uh, that's where you got the idea to try them for the presidential tourist. All right. Thank you for watching. Hope everyone has a nice day. This was delicious. And again, I'm so happy I tried it. Thank you for Coco Bakery for sending these. All right. Thank you. All right. Bye, everybody. Bye.